Hey guys, this is Million Dollar Mud again. Want to say hello to everybody. Uh, making another video. Uh, last video I was talking about the NFL 100 players. If you guys didn't see that video, great video on a strategy of making coins. You can see here in the page that I'm on now. I have about two Eric Dickersons that sold and two up for auction now. You can see Randy Moss there as well. Even Eric Dickerson down there and Devin Hester. As you guys see, I've been doing that for a while. I know in the last video, you guys saw the price he was at. If you guys didn't see that, take a look at it. Uh, you'll see now that he's up about, well, let's check. I think last I checked, it was like 470, somewhere around there. Let's see where he's at now. For the Rams okay yeah 471 if you guys saw the last video you'll see how the strategy um it does work uh, you'll see for yourselves check out that last video I don't want to give out any info now but now but if you guys see the last video um you guys will see that now in this video guys I'm gonna talk about another strategy of making coins um, I know you guys are aware of this I've seen this a lot on YouTube and you know other places people talked about it but there's certain ways to do things that people don't tell you okay you guys do know about the team of the year set I know how it's brought down the prices on team of the year cards but believe it or not they're still profitable and I'll tell you why as you guys see here um, for the team of year set you guys already know I know you guys know about the gingerbread men if you guys don't leave a comment below and I'm sure somebody on the channel will help you out. If not, I'll respond myself and help you out with that. Uh, you know, gingerbread men, you making this zero chill sets. I'll go over to that real quick. You see them here, you make gingerbread men. You need 280 to 82 overall cards. Now, I'm sure you guys seen this, like I said, in a lot of videos. But you guys haven't seen this way of doing it. Now, as you guys notice, a lot of people I know that they're searching 80 to 81 on auction and narrowing it down and trying to find the best possible price and things like that. Now, you have to understand that when you search like that, you're going to get plenty of prices all over the place. Uh, maybe around, you know, 11,000, somewhere around there. So you want to you want to buy at the least possible price. One way of doing it is looking 82 to 83. You know, a lot of people don't realize that, you know, you don't have to go for the lowest card to get the cheapest one. 82, if you could pick it up cheaper, it's still going to go in the gingerbread set. But even that, you know, sometimes, you know, doesn't work. So this is what I do, guys. I find an 82, right? Like this one here, I mean, it's common today because the Super Bowl Pass promo just came out today. So, you know... It's gonna be it's gonna be coming out a lot of packs, and I just click the LB button if you're on the Xbox. You can see here there's one for 5,500. Now that one sold already, but you can see there if I wasn't talking, I clicked earlier, I probably would have sniped it. But I kind of been doing as you guys see. I got I don't know six here, well seven if you count this one. Um, you know you just pick a couple 82 cards or 80 81s. Uh, I personally Personally, myself with 82s, I've had more luck, you know, and you click the LB button and you just go on there, you know, if you're not, doing, there, there you go. There's one for 81. You know, if you could pick those up, you know, someone bought that one, but if you could pick those up for 81, 8,000 around there, I mean, do the math guys, you know, you put, you know, two per set, you're talking about 16,000 at 8,000 a piece. I know there was one for 5,500 earlier, uh, but let's just say average around 8,000. Um, I'll do the math for you guys here, but if you guys see here, you know, let me see, eight times two is sixteen. You're gonna need, you're gonna need. Let me see here. You need twelve gingerbread men for the team of the year set. You need three gingerbread men for Adrian Peterson, another three for Adrian Peterson, and then one. For what's that linebacker? I can't think of his name now. The one on the lake, um, on the Raiders, uh, left outside linebacker. 
wow, I can't think of his name now. But anyways, you need six for him. So altogether, that's 12 times that by two. You're going to need 24, 80 to 82 cards. So if you do eight times 24, you're going to see it's 192, guys. Now, you add up 192 to, let's see, you need an 89 and an 87 to complete the set. You can see now, for instance, this one's 45. I'm sure you can get it for 40. I've seen 89s up for 35, 38. But let's put it at 45. Plus, let's see here. Plus 45. You're at 237. And then you need an 87, guys. Let's go to the auction block and see how much the 87s are. Now, guys, if you do this over and over again, it's going to take time, but you guys will make a lot of coins. I know there's a lot of no money spent players out there. Uh, you know, a lot of people work. You know, it's hard to, you know, spend money on a game and things like that. Uh, you know, trust me, I know I was young once, you know, so I try to do this to help you guys out. But see here, let's go to 87 now. Now you could filter and search. I'm just doing this really quickly to show you guys. Here's one for 26. I'm sure you get it cheaper, but let's add 26 to our math right now. So, guys, you're at 263,000, guys. For 263,000, you're going to get a 96 team of the year. Now, here's the good news, guys. The cheapest one up is 335. Take out 10% EA tax. You're looking at about, I don't know, 303, 305. Minus 263, 305. Minus 263. You're making 42,000 coins a pop. But guys, that's not even it. Every now and then, you're going to hit a Russell Wilson or a Aaron Donald. I mean, you're going to hit it. You know, in the more expensive cars like Jamal Adams and George Kittle. But you can see here, Aaron Donald, guys. So no matter what, you're not really taking risks if you're picking up the cards at the price that I'm saying it for. Because no matter what, you're making profit. And while you're making profit, every time you hit an Aaron Donald or Russell Wilson, for that matter. Let's see how much he's going for. Teams, Seahawks. Four, seven, even more. You're going to, I mean, guys, do the math. At 475 minus 263, you're looking at about 200,000 coins profit. Take out, you know, the 10% EA tax. You're still looking at about 160,000 coins, guys. You know, you add that up and you do that throughout the day. You know, like I said, you got to take your time. Um, I know it's a strategy that you got to, you know, it takes time. It's not going to be done in five minutes, 10 minutes. It's going to take time. But guys... If you do this strategy, it will work. You will make coins and you will make your team a higher overall because you'll have the coins to do so. As you see here, you know, we click on it again. I mean, this was 9,600, but you know, guys, you could pick up quite a few 82s. You know, I just got this one up right now just to show you guys, but there's hundreds of 82s, probably more. You know, you pick up a few of them and you just LB on, on them. It's going to take you straight to that auction and it's going to filter that exact player. That's what makes this strategy so good and so efficient. Because it's not going to search in volume. This is going to give you the cheapest possible price for that player, guys. You know, guys, uh, you, you see we picked up 250 uh, Barry Sanders earlier in my last video. If you didn't see that, take a look at that. There's only one up now. Eventually that will sell. I could put him up now. You know, and, and, and make profit now, but I'm going to wait. But I'm showing you guys these strategies. This is the second strategy I'm showing you. I got more strategies as well, but you guys see, I mean, it's just common sense. You will make coins. Now, like I said before in my last video, with every investment, there's risk. The market goes up and down. Things change. It's very important that you guys know that when you do this, you know, and if you if things don't go well, you know, don't say, oh, it didn't go well for me or this and that. With everything, there's risk, guys. You, if you do it the right way, just like I taught you guys, you guys are going to make coins. You know, and like I said before in my last video, if you guys didn't hear, I'm giving away a 93 Lamar Jackson as soon as we hit 150 subscribers. It's going to be randomly chosen. 
leave a like, leave a comment, subscribe. Um, also, click the bell notification so you guys know every video that I do. And the more videos you leave comments, likes, we will go ahead and um, you have a better chance to randomly be chosen. The winner will be disclosed on our Twitter account that we just opened. You can see it on the link below. And it will be done once we reach 150 subscribers. Now, you guys know the 93 Lamar Jackson, he goes up for around three something around there. Uh, I'm sure he's going to be a lot more expensive if and when he gets his MVP honors card, which will be a 98 overall. Something to help you guys out. I know he's a fun quarterback to play with, and that 98 MVP honors card, to be honest, if he winds up getting it, it's going to be it's going to be a cheat code. I mean, it's going to be crazy. So uh, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I do like to say that I enjoy you guys, how um, quickly you guys are subscribing. Uh, please leave comments below. I'm still working, you know, things out, working out kinks. Still trying to learn this thing. This is new to me. If you guys could help me out, give me any pointers, I will appreciate. I look forward to helping you guys out and uh, the community helping each other for EA uh, Madden. And um, I look forward to our next videos. I appreciate it, guys, and have a good day.